Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Gladiator headquarters. And today I am super excited to show you this brand new 2021 Jeep Gladiator Mojave Edition in Snazberry Pearl Coat. This vehicle has an award-winning 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor, which pumps out 285 horsepower. It's gonna get you 22 miles per gallon on the highway, 17 city, and an average of 19 miles per gallon. This one's gonna be able to tow 6,000 pounds. It has a payload capacity of 1,200 pounds. And we're gonna go over all the options and information that I can give you on this vehicle and go over the specifics of the options that this vehicle has and we shoot all of our videos in 1080p 60 frames per second so if you have HD capabilities on your computer tablet or smartphone device turn them on right now because it is your best way to check out those options looks and styling and the color of the vehicle before seen it in person. If you'd like to check out our website in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to this vehicle on our website to check out all the photos and pricing and everything like that. Anyways, we'll get right into it. I uh, do really like the Mojave styling. You get the Mojave stickers on the hood. You get the orange tow hooks. You get the special Falcon Wild Peak AT3W tires. You also get the rock rails and everything's basically outlined in orange on this thing. You get the desert rated badge, which is, this is the only vehicle that is desert rated from Jeep. And you get the Jeep logo in granite crystal with the orange outline. You get the special, actually these are extra rims. These are 17 inch painted and polished aluminum rims um, on this vehicle. They're an extra $995 to get these special rims. You do get the little Jeep logo on there. These Wild Peak tires are LT285 70R17s. They're kind of an aggressive tire designed for off-roading purposes. And then you get the two and a half inch internal bypass shocks from Fox. It also has a one inch lift on it. It has 11.6 inches of ground clearance which is actually a half inch higher than the Rubicon version of the Gladiator. So this is the tallest um, or best ground clearance Gladiator you can buy. You also get the Fox shocks, jounce bumpers, so designed for off-roading in the desert and taking the shocks and everything um, of off-roading. This one has the LED lighting group, which gives you the LED running lights in the fenders, the LED projector lamp headlamps, the LED running lights in there as well, and the LED fog lamps too. These orange tow hooks are actually powder coated, and you do get on this one the special satin grill, which is a really good look on here. You get the cowl hood with the hood scoop right in the middle there. Really a good looking vehicle. A couple of little Easter eggs on the Mojave, well actually any Wrangler. Uh, you get the sandals on the plastic piece there and you also get the Jeep climbing up the side of your hood. You get the T50 on the doors, um, hinges so you know which Torx wrench to take those doors off with. The rock rails are part of the Mojave package for off-roading. This one comes with skid plates on just about every vital mechanical piece underneath the vehicle, including the front skid plate right there. It's got a fuel tank skid plate, it's got a differential skid plate, transmission skid plate, and those are all under here, which you can't really see anything because all you can see are skid plates. But that's to protect your vehicle in off-roading situations. It does have the enter and go system with the keyless entry system here. Here's the original window sticker. I'm not going to go over th everything because it's just a nightmare to read everything on here. I will show you that uh, it is the Snazberry Pearl Coat 3.6 liter 8 speed. You get the Jeep Wave membership. There's all your off road stuff. You do get the heavy duty Dana 44 inch wide front and rear axles. Those are solid axles, better for off roading in the desert. Um, those 17-inch rims 
are actually you get the low gloss black polished wheels which is 995 so those take precedent over the stock ones um, but everything on the left here is your standard equipment Optional equipment is the Snazberry Pearl Coat, which is 245. The leather trim bucket speed bucket seats are 15.95. Trailer tow package, which is 350, gives you the class uh, four receiver hitch and trailer hitch zoom. Cold weather group gives you heated seats, heated steering wheel, and remote start. The premium lighting group is 12.95. The 8.4 radio and premium audio group is 18.95, which gives you the nav. The off-road pages, the Alpine Premium Audio System, Sirius Guardian for a year, five-year Sirius Traveling, five-year Traffic Plus, and then Automatic Dimming Rearview Mirror. The Safety Group is $8.95, gives you blind spot and cross path detection, and Remote Keyless Entry, which is the Enter and Go System, which is $5.45, Color Match Hardtops $23.95, and the Body Color Fenders are $6.95, that gloss, I'm sorry, that satin black grill is 195 which I showed you before comes with the wireless Bluetooth speaker which I'll show you in just a second and your total MSRP is 59780 if you want to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of the screen is a link to our website click that and check us out there for all the rebates and incentives on this particular Jeep three year 36 bumper to bumper five year 60 powertrain and there's your miles per gallon there's your safety ratings four and five star front crash not rated for anything else except rollover which is three stars. Whew. Anyways, I do want to show you the wireless, wireless Bluetooth speaker, which is pretty cool. So it's actually located behind the passenger side back seat, and it's located right here. It actually sits right in there, and that's where it charges. To get it out, you just pull this strap. It'll unlock, and you can just remove it. So you can take it to wherever you're going. Um, take it with you and it should always be charged and then you can connect it to your cell phone play music from your cell phone or whatever you know musical storage device you have that's Bluetooth capable and it's kind of cool just to have a speaker kind of wherever you go and then it just kind of sits right back in there and then it'll snap in kind of hard to see exactly how that goes all right so you got to get it right in this got to get it right in that knob there and once you do that it'll snap in there quite easily and then it locks in like so you do get the sliding rear window that is a manual slide so you have to actually unlatch it and slide it like that and then it snaps in. You do get those bolts back here to take that hard top off. And to get this back seat up, you can go like that. Now the cool part about these back seats is they lock with the ignition key so that uh, you can store stuff back there when you do have the top off and you don't have to worry about anybody stealing your valuables. These headrests also fold down for better visibility when you're, nobody's riding back there. You do get a storage bin underneath here as well so stuff doesn't go rolling around. This is the bag that was holding the wireless Bluetooth speaker. Floor mats snap into place back here as well. They do have the rock guards, the 3M tape rock guards on your back fenders, which is nice so they're not gonna get sandblasted or rock chipped up. You get the internal bypass shocks back here as well. And uh, I did wanna show you just all the heavy duty Suspension back here, solid axles, you get the springs, um, sway bar there. Everything's a little bit heavier duty on the Mojave than the other Gladiator model, models. Backup parking sensors, you get the tow hooks back here too. Full towing package, which includes that receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. And remember, you can tow up to 6,000 pounds with this Gladiator. Locking tailgate has the shock down assist tailgate. You get the LED bed lighting. I do have the front hard top case back here just for video purposes. And then if you ever noticed, it says heart 419 right there. A lot of people wonder what that means. It is the area code for 
Toledo, Ohio, which is where these are made. So little Easter egg nugget there. You'll notice you get the dirt bike, dirt bike tire tread pattern up there. So that's so when you put your dirt bikes up there, they got a nice spot to sit in. And then you can actually prop this tailgate up by putting the strap through there. And there's one on that side too. And then your tailgate will sit up like that. So if you do have bikes back there, they're not gonna roll out the back on you. So that's kind of a neat system there too. All the fun stuff you learn at a Jeep dealership. That tailgate locks, it's very easy to lift and put down. You get those LED tail lamps and uh, the rock rails here. Color match hardtop looks really good on the Gladiator. Do get that blind spot, cross path detection, heated mirrors, enter and go system. Inside the Mojave package when you get the leather trim seats, gives you the leather trim seats with all the orange stitching, the Mojave stitched into the backrest. Even the handle for the backrest is uh, stitched in orange. Driver seat height adjuster, lumbar, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, orange stitching on the door, orange stitching on the dash trim. You get the orange bezels around the air vents there. Auto headlamps, tilt, telescopic steering wheel, the orange stitching on the steering wheel. And by now I'm pretty sure everybody's sick of me saying orange. We'll start up the ignition here so you can take a look at all that cool animation when you start up the, Wrang or the Gladiator here. And you can see a digital speedometer, you get a compass, outside temp display. You can change those corners to read whatever you'd like. That leather wrap steering wheel, it's a really nice soft touch leather. Get the thumb pads on there. Bluetooth and information center controls, cruise controls on the right, audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. This one does come with that 8.4 4C radio, which gives you the navigation system. Remember, this one has the premium Alpine sound system as well. AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. That factory nav. You get your climate controls here. You can do your backup camera, which is an HD backup camera. Those grid lines are dynamic, meaning as you turn that steering wheel, they're going to turn with you. And then that center line lines right up with your receiver hitch. And because you have the um, trailer tow package on here, you get the plus. So you'll zoom in right over that receiver hitch. So you'll get hooked up to your boat, camper, trailer the first time, every time. And nobody will need to really help you because you'll be able to see right over the hitch. Pretty cool stuff. You also have your apps here. So first thing I'll show you is the projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. So if you have a navigation system on your cell phone, such as Waze or Google Maps, project it to the screen, you can use it there, use it through the screen. Same thing with music, media, all that good stuff. And uh, we actually did a demo on Android Auto. If you want to check that out, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. Uh, click that and check us out there. And then you have the off-road pages, which are really the two main things that I like to go over. It always says something cool may be lost, but never stuck. Um, in a gladiator which is kind of neat so the off-road pages you get your latitude longitude you also have your altitude there your pitch and roll which is going to be handy if you're doing a lot of off-roading you can see your decline or how high you're accelerating there is really cool and then your roll make sure you're not going to tip it and then you also have your accessory gauges your coolant temp oil temp battery voltage trans temp and oil pressure and then your drivetrain, you can do your steering angle. You can see that changes as you turn the steering wheel. And then you can see your rear axle locker if it's locked or unlocked. And if you're in two wheel high, two wheel, four wheel high or four wheel low. And then, um, so you can do all that stuff there, including your climate controls. Now, if you don't like doing your climate controls up here, you can do them down here. You also have your heated seats and heated steering wheel buttons down here, volume and tune controls, start-stop capabilities, stability control, parking sensors, your select speed crawl control. Down here you got a media center with an AUX USB and USB-C jack. That's where you would connect your Android Auto or Apple CarPlay phone to. you got to connect it through a, phone, a cable to get that to work. 
Then you have your axle locker here, and you can only rock, lock the rear axle. Um, but you can do, when you have the rear axle locked and you're in four-wheel drive low, you can actually go up to 50 miles per hour. Um, in a Rubicon, you can only do 30, but this one, because of all the desert-rated and off-roading capabilities that it has, you can do up to 50 in four-wheel drive low because of how it's geared. I believe it's 272 gears as opposed to the 4.0 gears. And then off-road mode plus is a uh, system. When you push that, you can uh, actually, it'll change your shift points, it'll change your throttle for better off-roading capabilities in the desert. So a lot of cool stuff. I wish we had a desert out back that we could do some videos of it in, but we don't because we're in Wisconsin. You do get the Gladiator logo on top of the 8-speed automatic transmission. You get the flipper style key, keyless entry, remote start, definitely a bulky, chunky key. And then this dash, I really like the dash. So like some of these are like a really smooth satin finish, like the Saharas you get, in the Wranglers at least, you get like a leather trim uh, dash. Now these are painted, but it's, it's a, a really rough, it's almost like sandpaper and I'm almost, I guaranteed Jeep did that on purpose because of the off-roading desert capabilities of the vehicle. So that's kind of neat too. The hardtop pieces, they all come off just like the Wranglers and all the other Gladiators. So nothing very special there. You get your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, SOS and assist, and your auto dimming mirror. But the cool part is you can still take the hardtop off which you can't do in about 99% of the other vehicles on the market. So I did want to show you one last thing other than the back seats, which we already kind of looked at. You do get the latch child safety system. You get your storage for all your bolts back here. And then you also get another storage behind this seat that locks as well. And then you do get 115 volt power point back here, two USBs, two USB-Cs, but, and then child safety locks. But what I really want to show you is that LED bed lighting. You turn those on with the cargo lamps and that'll turn those lights on. I wanted to show you the LED tail lamps, the LED license plate lights, and we'll do one more final walk around here on the Jeep. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you will gotten a really good idea of the overall look, styling, options, and uh, learned a couple things about the Jeep Gladiator Mojave. Check out these front LED lights. Really like those lights, they're super bright. Wish my Wrangler, when I had one, would have had those lights, but anyways. Thanks for checking out the video, and if you want to check out more HD videos or more vehicles, from our lineup, you can go to that website right there, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. Link to more Jeep Gladiator videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be offering the 2021 Jeep Gladiator Mojave in Snazberry Pearl Code. Thanks again for checking out the video.